Here's what I don't get about this game. So we have these platforms here, and then before we had the really annoying platforms that were like, no, you have to master the timing. Why have the easier platform here when you could have very easily used the harder platform here? Get the kitties used to the idea of platforming before you take away their hopes and dreams at the very start of the level. You know, it's decisions like these that just, it doesn't make any sense. It really doesn't. Run. Run, you fool. Run. Well, whatever. He got shine sparked in the head and shine sparked again and then there we go. He made it. Level complete. Got a life. Sid, a kid who's cruel to his toys, uses the claw to pick up Buzz Woody, trying to keep Buzz from being taken, grabs, oh, Woody, trying to keep Buzz from being taken, grabs Buzz's leg and is lifted up to him, smiling. Sid moves both toys to his surprise sheet and he takes his new toys and heads home to play. Look out for Sid! This level kinda sucks too! Fairy tales! Do it yourself! Cause Sid Totally had a book of fairy tales. Totally. Nice landing. Run, Woody, run! Swim through that air. Is it almost time for breakfast cereal? <laughs> Shoot! Are you kidding me? At least this level I don't, like, it's not timed, it's not, like, the only thing is that you have to do the platforming, and if you can't do the platforming, then that's your fault, you know? It's, I like that. And there is kind of a sense of urgency, but it's not portrayed through, like, timing or anything. And then you fall. And it's back to the start. I mean, like, even though the game kind of sucks, it still retains difficulty. I like that. I like that a lot. And the difficulty is more like, can you freaking do this? And if you can't, well, it sucks to be you. This is coming fresh from that Pokemon freaking playthrough part. What are we on? Like three? Screw it, let's swim. Looks like I'm gonna have to jump. I've been watching Speemales lately. Even though there hasn't been any new ones, I just enjoy watching. There we go. Oh god. I forgot you had to move slow. Okay, the cereal's coming up. Here we go. Well, first we have to get to the cereal. There we go. Okay. Let's see if I can remember how to do this. That's not fair. Okay. 
Here we go. Here we go. Ah, my head is on fire. Okay, cool. It gets harder. Trust me. It gets so much. Here we go. The part where you had the platform while being like this. Yeah, here we go. Oops, that didn't work. Platforming! Nice! Alright, level completed! Yeah! When Sid is called downstairs by his mother, it gives Woody a chance to look around the bedroom for Buzz, and unknown to Woody, lurking in the dark shadows, something is watching his every move very closely. Okay, here we go. Things are happening. Oh, yeah, you forgot about that part. I can't believe you're so stupid. Oh, God, I forget about that. Freaking bananas. Um, ta -da. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. He used to be able to do this like so easily, like, do to do. Nice and slow. Never mind the jumping physics, just go for it. There we go. Check me out. No! It's okay. Not my fault. Oh, are you freaking kidding me? Looks like I'm gonna have to jump! <laughs> Dead jump. He's just like, Wee! Wait, where's the ground? There we go! Look at that jumping skill. Okay. Uh, now what? Uh, now what? Jump for it! Ah. I forgot about this. This is actually, like, platforming pretty well done. Like, for all the gripes I give this game, platforming's pretty good. I mean, besides all the bugs with the 
weird, uh, grippy controls, but hey, you know, no game's perfect. You can't really expect games to be perfect. <laughs> 